from your weather authority, Chief Meteorologist Wayne Hart. Those are our third consecutive day in the deep freeze, but we'll break that melting point tomorrow, at least get back into the 40s for Thursday and Friday, and then a spring-like Saturday that will feature rain and at least the potential for some strong to severe storms. We'll check the latest guidance here in just a moment. But today in western Kentucky, you did briefly get above the melting point. 37 in Madisonville, Henderson hit 33, Owensboro 35, but north of the river, lower 30s for the most part. And we'll be about, uh, well, I'd say about 10 degrees warmer tomorrow. Not back to normal just yet, but certainly moving in the right direction. And live first warning Doppler radar clear right now. And for the most part tomorrow, it's going to stay clear. A little light snow headed for our northern counties, but it's later tomorrow night into Friday morning when uh, rain chances begin to pick up a little bit more. Here's our King Sky Cam off the top of Fifth Third Bank, downtown Evansville, looking down on the Lloyd Expressway on a partly cloudy night. We still have that mid to high level cloud cover moving in. And after topping out at 32 this afternoon, we're still at 30 degrees. So the temperature is not dropping that much despite calm conditions out there. I think we will drop a few more degrees, generally about 25 to 30 currently, 27 Henderson, 30 in Owensboro. I think we'll drop into the mid to upper 20s overnight, then hold pretty steady. That mid to high level cloud cover still coming in from the northwest in advance of a developing warm front. And there's that band of snow. We've been talking about this all week long for Thursday morning. And earlier in the week, it looks like that, it looked like at least that band could get all the way down to the Ohio River. But the latest guidance is steering it mainly north of the tri state. So I don't think this is going to be an issue for us tomorrow. Here's an updated future tracker increasing the clouds overnight. And then a mostly cloudy Thursday. And a little light snow is going to flirt with our northern counties. But the latest run keeps us dry through noon. And even at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, just a little bit of light snow way up here in the northern fringe. So otherwise, just a gray day, but not as cold. We'll be in the lower 40s tomorrow afternoon. So it will feel better out there. And I think tomorrow evening will be okay until around midnight. And that's when a little bit of scattered light rain, little light snow will be breaking out across the area. But any kind of mix will quickly go over to all liquid by daybreak on Friday. And it's not going to be all that heavy. And temperatures will be in the middle 30s. And on Friday, the better chances for rain will be in western Kentucky during the morning hours. I think in Evansville, it may turn out to be just another gray and fairly quiet day. A bit warmer will be a mid, maybe upper 40s across the area under cloudy skies. And if you have plans for Friday night, it looks dry at this point. Maybe a spotty light shower or two, and not all that cold. We're just going to fall through the 40s, and by daybreak Saturday morning, we'll be right around 40 degrees with a little scattered light rain moving in first thing in the morning, and then that rain really increases towards the noon hour, and though this may not be good news for outdoor plans on Saturday, this will help hopefully lower the severe weather threat, very much like what happened a couple of weekends ago. When we had that severe weather threat, the rain came in, and sh shut everything down and push the storms into the Tennessee Valley. That may indeed be what happens here, but we are under a marginal to slight risk. If the atmosphere can recover later in the afternoon, there's a developing line west of Evansville at 3 p.m., and that's moving east of Highway 41 by 6 o'clock on Saturday evening. Rainfall amounts will be significant, not overly heavy, but around an inch across a good deal of the area with the system on Saturday. So clouds increasing overnight. Mid-20s, maybe rising a bit towards daybreak. Mostly cloudy tomorrow, not as cold. And just a little scattered light snow in our northern counties. Highs into the 40s. And then a little wintry mix later tomorrow night. Going over to a little rain Friday morning. Ending pretty quickly, especially north of the river, 45. And then rain developing later Saturday morning. Turning heavy at times and maybe ending as some storms. Late afternoon, early evening. Very windy and a much warmer 65. Sunday should be a pretty decent day with some sun. It will be very windy. It will be cooler, but seasonable with highs in the low 50s. And then we kind of warm back to some more rain and thunder Tuesday night and Wednesday of next week. We'll make those weather aware days. So we're out of the deep freeze tomorrow. So a little on the cold side Thursday, Friday, but it will feel like marching in over the weekend. Let's just hope we can keep any severe weather threat down to our south on Saturday. And we'll continue to monitor that over the next couple of days. Okay. Sounds good, Wayne. Thank you.